Welcome to the CatDV workflow demos. Today's feature is going to be review and approval with both the rich client and the web client. So today's review and approval is very simple. So I've set up some of this stuff in CatDV's worker node. And very simply what I've done is I've created a server query that allows me to send a clip record, which is similar to this record that I've selected here, via a status field. So I have the status field up here. I've selected a single asset. And I mark this clip as send to Ed and then simply save to server. Our worker node application is going to pick that up and push this asset into an, a catalog called Eduardo's Inbox. So if I look in Eduardo's Inbox right now, there's nothing there. But if I refresh from the server, which is under the server menu up here, refresh window, double click, there's my asset. And it was marked in the status field as sent to Ed. So we even know that this was sent to Ed. Then Eduardo would log in, see this clip, and then also use the status field to either approve or reject this asset. So then this asset is now able to be marked as approved by Eduardo. And we've made that a field value of approved by Ed. So simply marking it as approved by Ed, command S, save to server. And now that stuff is going to move from this to be approved catalog or Eduardo's inbox and go into a catalog that we have called approved assets. So if I click on approved assets, there's my approved asset in the approved catalog with a status that it says approved by Eduardo. Hi, I'm Eduardo Silva. Today I'm going to be showing you how to use the CatDV web client, which is the remote access tool to your CatDV database. Now from the web client, it can access the Eduardo Inbox catalog, and I can select any of these clips for playback, as you can see here. Once I'm ready to approve this asset, I can simply check the uh, start editing the clip, and you can see my interface changes. And now I actually am able to switch the clip status to something other than send to Ed. And I'm going to simply ap approve this clip and hit OK. And when I click this little checkbox here, I will write this information back to the CatDV server, which is living on a machine back in my own home office, where the worker node can now take the status change and trigger an automation. And that automation is simply moving the asset to another catalog called Approved Assets. And here you see that same uh, file in a different catalog. And that's a review and approval process using the web client. Thanks for joining us on this demo, and be sure to check us out at jbna.com.